Hello, this is Relapse 101, or Michael speaking. Today I'm doing a short commentary on a new game I recently got called Super Meat Boy. Super Meat Boy's been around for a while, but I recently found out about it, thought I'd give it a try. That was actually was released in October 2008, and um, on Flash, and later released in 2010 on Xbox and PC, I believe. Um, it's um, a really indie game, uh, and it's got many um, awards. Well, not awards, but just is well known for being really difficult, but um, really intuitive and um, a really hard puzzle game. Um, you're basically this well piece of meat called Meat Boy, and you've got to save Bandage Girl, I think it is, from uh, Doctor Fetus, the evil Doctor Fetus. And you've got to go through a bunch of different puzzles or mazes, and yeah, that's basically for that. Um, yeah, it got um, it got the most challenging game from IGN in 2010, and it also received awards for best downloadable game from Gamespot and Game Trailers in the same year. Um, this is my first gameplay that I did of it, um, so it's not that hard yet, but I can see how it could get a lot harder. Um, you just gotta, yeah, well obviously the rate, the, the saws kill you, um, I was using an Xbox controller on my PC when I recorded this, um, and yeah, I was just figuring out the controls, and yeah, I sort of just recorded as soon as I jumped into the game, so I didn't know too much about it when I started recording. I'm doing this commentary a few hours later, so yeah. Um, it's pretty simple to get the hang of, but uh, mastering it will be another thing. Um, it's done really well. Uh, it's one of the top games on GameSpot for the year, I think, and it received 9.5, which is quite a high score. I really like the um, the art style. It's sort of a uh, pixely indie game. It's not um, graphically amazing, but it's the style makes it really nice. Um, yeah, there's not a lot more. I'll probably release a few more videos of it when it gets a bit more difficult, so you can see my frustration. I'm not the greatest at puzzle games, but I give them a good shot. Um, yeah, so I thought I'd release this commentary because I haven't done one in a little while, and I want to start playing a few more different games, like more indie games and that. I'm um. Soon I might be doing one on Gorshasp, the Monster Slayer. Um, I think that's how you say it, Garshasp. It, uh, it only came out today, it's May the 10th, so I think that'll be an interesting game. It looks really fun, and it was only cheap, so I recommend anyone to get that. I think it's um, $17 on the Steam Marketplace, I could be wrong. Um, yeah, oh, $18 on the Steam Marketplace, so um, I'm downloading that and I'll, I might do a commentary on that, uh, depending on how that goes. Um, this game is starting to wrap up now. Um, if you like this video or this commentary, leave it a thumbs up or subscribe. Um, yeah, it was, uh, if you want to see more content, leave a comment or if you've got any suggestions, leave a comment. Thanks for watching, this is Relapse101 and I'll see you later.